who's up first. How'd it feel to be back out there? You know, it felt good. Um, you know, when you uh, don't play a game for three months and uh, come back, you can be a little bit rusty. So there's some things, just, you know, routine things that I could have hit uh, and done a better job of. Um, but when that does happen, you know, you got a decision to make. You can either just, you know, fold or, you know, fight through it. So, uh, you know, I'm happy with how I fought through it. The guys helped me, you know, get through some of that. And, um, you know, we just got to find ways to start fast and finish strong. I felt like we did a good job coming out in the second half and, and putting points on the board and giving ourselves a chance uh, uh, to win the game. But, you know, we can't dig ourselves into a hole like that um, to have to claw out of it. When you say routine things, do you mean just missing throws or not seeing guys or both? No, no. I mean, um, I felt like I saw the field well. Um, you didn't miss any many guys, uh, if any. Uh, just a routine check down throw here and there. I feel like those things are simple, easy, simple things that uh, the rust definitely showed there. Um, uh, you know, you don't want to miss a throw and make a throw. Miss a throw and make a throw. I feel like those were the things that uh, I was a little rusty on. Um, and I can fix that easily by just continuing to play. And uh, I feel like I fought through a lot of that today and, you know, still try to give the team a chance to win. I know it can't be good to take a shot from perfect like you did. <laughs> Is it good to take one like that and get up and be able to continue? Yeah, Vontaze's a great player, man. And uh, he got me good. But um, I believe that's the one where Duke, you know, went down the field. So it was worth it. And uh, But, yeah, it, it definitely shows me that, you know, I, sh I can be able to take hits. Obviously, we don't want to get the quarterback hit. But, um, you know, it's football. It's a physical sport. And, uh, you know, I was able to take some shots today and get back up and, and continue to play. Are you happy with the way you protected yourself, whether it was running out of bounds or whatever else you needed to do? To yeah, there were some street ball elements to some of the things we did today. <laughs> and um, uh, running around and protecting myself was uh, I didn't really take any shots, uh, you know, down the field, running the ball. Um, you know, something that, you know, I've tried to you know, continue to get better at uh, over the course of my career. So I felt like that was good. But, you know, all this is a side note. You know, we just we want to find ways uh, to win the football game. Uh, so for me, it's not about stats. It's not about how many uh, catches this guy had or that guy had or how many rushing yards that guy had. Uh, we just got to find ways to, to do things early on in the game and late in the game to win the game. Uh, and I think that'll be That'll be our focus. Coach, is, you know, he's always preaching that to us. And, and those guys in the locker room want it. They deserve it. Uh, and it's just about us demanding that out of them every single day. Did you, you and Corey uh, didn't seem to connect very well. I think it was zero out of six targets in the first half, two for nine, and then like three for 11 by the end of the game, playing 26 yards. Kind of what was going on between you and Corey and what needs to go better? No, nah, it's not, uh, you know, just between me and Corey. It's just about, you know, making sure everybody uh, is in the right spot, making sure our timing is on. Uh, and the Bengals did a good job of disrupting that uh, with some of the looks that they showed uh, and some of the pressure that they did get. But, um, you know, we just got to find ways to, to be high percentage in the passing game. We did a great job running the ball and, and maneuvering. So, you know, when you rush for that many yards, you definitely expect the outcome to be a little bit different. So as a team, as an offense, we just have to figure out ways uh, to get our, our passing game going, uh, even if it is without those big chunk plays. How'd you come out of it physically when you're talking about taking all those hits? Yeah, yeah I'm fine. You know, <laughs> football is physical. And uh, it, it's, for, it's for the tough man. So uh, all those guys that, that play out there on that field are tough. Uh, and you just got to make sure you brush it off and get ready for the next week. What did you see on the uh, interception on the flea flicker? Yeah, on the flea flicker, I just uh, one, one or two things. Got to get him a better ball or just throw it away. Um, the, the backside safety did a good job cross keying across the field. Uh, and, and Corey uh, was on the other side of the field with the corner, but the corner was on top of him too. So um, really just manage a bad play uh, and either throw it uh, a little farther so TP can run underneath it or throw it out of bounds. Hey, Coach, were they doing a good job of taking Terrell away from you or what? Terrell only had three targets. You only connected with him one time and then obviously the flea flicker. But what was going on in there? Were they taking him away or why couldn't you? No, I mean, they just uh, they did a good job playing, uh, you know, combo coverages deep and soft. And, uh, you know, we just got to come up uh, with ways to, to get TP involved. And uh, he's a great player, so you want to try to get the ball to him. Uh, but I think that all comes with you know our offense just flowing better early. Uh, all the, everybody will get their touches if we're flowing a lot better than we were early on in the game, and we can't put ourselves in a you know 20-0 hole.
Hey, your coach said, uh, given how little you played the last two years, people should be understanding about, you know, what the results are. Do you, how do you feel about that? Uh, you know, I don't ever expect anybody to be understanding when it comes to me. So I, I, I could, I, I don't. That never crosses my mind. Um, but you know, the more I play, uh, the better it'll get. And uh, you know, it's tough to to be off for for three months during the course of a season and come back in the game and expect everything to go perfectly. It didn't go perfectly, uh, but I thought as a team, um, we did a good job fighting through the things that didn't go perfect. You know, we hurt ourselves too much with penalties, uh, the turnover we can't have, uh, but we fought back from all those things and put ourselves in position uh, to have a chance at twenty to ten in the fourth. Saw Terrell barking when you guys had to take that one time out. Right, right, right. Are you guys fine? Yeah, I mean, we're fine. It, it wasn't anything big. He just wanted to run the play. <laughs> and uh, we, we got so low on the, on the game clock uh, that we needed to take a timeout. So that's what we were talking about. He just wanted to run the play that was called. Uh, but as, you know, as a team, we decided in the huddle that we needed to call a timeout so that we could actually execute it. And you know, we scored on that drive. So it all worked out.